Alright, hello everyone and welcome back to my Fallout 4 mini-series of Lima Detachment, where today we are still in the underground base for the Sigma Squad, one of apparently several different enclave groups that have made their way into the Commonwealth, and slightly unnerving that they seem to have found their way into an FEV research center of some form. But, oh well, what are you gonna do? I mean, it's not like we don't already have super mutants out here. <laughs> What's the worst the Enclave could do with the FEV? Oh yeah, that was kind of the plot of one of the games. Ha! All right, so yes, we still have two locked up parts of uh, this particular base to go and explore, and I'm hoping we should be able to finish that up pretty quickly here today and then head back out into the glowing sea to look for one of the four remaining areas. Now, actually, let's take a look at them real quick. What is the next closest one? All right, so that's where the next four different bases are. And, okay, so we have the NCR crash site next, so that is the closest. Then we'll work our way down to the Brotherhood Recon Bunker, the Vault 71, and finally, the Lone Wanderer's Hideout. Oh, I'm looking forward to that one the most, and I think that will make for a grand, well, hopefully grand, final episode. So let us, uh, well, unclick these things for now so I don't have an annoying little marker on my compass, and let us head over here to this wing of the base, which apparently is the Federal Depot. Ooh, hopefully there's some really good stuff to steal in here. I see an armory! Can I get into the armory? Oh, I can. Oh, uh, yeah, let's actually turn on a light so we can see. Oh, fusion cores. Oh, and fusion cells. It's all lootable! My god. All right, now here's the big question. No, oh, these aren't lootable. That is by far the most disappointing part of this mod so far. So many things which are just set dressing, which I would love to take. I mean, come on, all these beautiful plasma rifles. How oh, fine, I'll just make do with plasma cartridges for now. Oh, hello, we have a weapon depot terminal. What sort of fun lore do we have here? So, weapon sign-outs on January 22nd. What do we got? T. Dawson, Captain, uh, got a Winchester P94 plasma rifle. And some cartridges, some rations, stim packs. Alright, so it's just what these guys signed out for their mission that they went and that we read about in the last episode. Yes, a lot of good things, a lot of good things. And, of course, the other team. Harriet Terrence. Gotta love those plasma rifles. And Gatling laser. Oh, yeah, that's, uh, that's the good stuff. Okay, so what do they sign back in? Did they, get, did they return all of their things? I mean, I'm gonna assume so, or, you know. Well, turn in the gun at least. Ooh, he did use a few rounds of uh, his plasma. Okay, I mean, this isn't the, exactly the most interesting thing, but uh, you know what, it's, it's a nice little nice little bit of world building. And considering we did read about their mission in the last episode, it is kind of cool that then we could see what they took with them. Alright, so that is the Weapon Depot Terminal. Bobby pins, take those. Hello, door! Oh god, I gotta be looking for a card. Alright, we'll go back in there in a moment. First, loot all of the ammunition, because of course I will. Uh, oh, we can't even take the mini... Uh, yep, definitely the part that annoys me the most about this mod. I want all the things! All of the things! Alright, uh, what have we got in here? Yeah, nothing useful. Alright, let's look back in here real quick, just in case I missed a security card. And we need to get into the next area. Because we do have one more locked door, and it does not appear to be one in here. Oh, hello. Take all of you, and you, and through here. Ooh. Little, uh, little briefing room, and not- Oh! Yo! God, I'm being shot at! What? Where? Oh, it's a rad roach. <laughs> I thought I was being shot by, like, a turd or something. It was a roach. Thanks, dog meat. Thank you, buddy. 
All right, we got some technical documents and someone was uh, drinking a bit before giving their briefings. Well, that doesn't seem like a safe idea. Uh, napkins, well, you, you gotta stay clean. I like it. Ooh, Boston sector map, very nice, very cool. I do love all the little details. Well, this doesn't look very bunker-esque. <laughs> Ooh, hello, what do we have? Oh, it's, oh, it's like a little training area for, like, they're doing room clearing techniques. Cool. That's actually a very cool little touch. I like it. This is like a little target practice room. Oh, that is awesome. That is a very cool little detail. Take down the paper signs. All right. Anything else fun? Oh, got to shoot that too, of course. There we go. Yeah, you, you can't not shoot it. it. It'd just be rude. They're giving you the targets to have fun with. Nope, no one, no one in the laundry. <laughs> I hear a red roach. Nope, nope, that may just have been dog meat. Nope, no one in the bathroom. Ah, take him down! And him! All right, there we go. We've taken out everything. Nope, oh, uh, you're special. Hmm, hold on a moment at the beginning of the game. That gives you a perk. Does, does this one? Oh, my God, it does. Crap, what do I need? I don't I don't remember what this character needs at the moment. Uh, uh, agility? What, what is my agility? Ah, crap. Oh, nope, nope, there we go. I thought it was at full there for a second, but nope, nope, we're good. We gained one agility. Awesome. <laughs> Actually, probably should... Ah, Jangles! The real target. Yeah, I probably probably should have uh, put that into luck. That's actually my lowest stat, but oh well. What are you gonna do? Now this, this was a very cool world building touch. I like this, a little training room with the room clearing tactics. That's, that's awesome, that's very, very cool. So, through this door now. Oh, also, what does this map show? Hello. Huh. All right. Oh no, poor Iceland's on the target side. And hmm, Ireland cut in two by the target side of the world. Look at that. <laughs> All right, through the store. What do we have? Ooh, not going in there. Red Rush! Overkill with the shotgun and my, my god, how did it take that many shots to kill him? And for a shower room. What a waste. Ah, this is where we're probably gonna find that key I need. Ooh. Oh, dog meat, you knocked over some weights. Still not seeing this card. Hmm. Uh-oh. Nice little models. Hmm. Yeah, not seeing it. Well, let's see. Maybe the commander's terminal. Who knows? Maybe it has, like, a, a door unlock thing. All right. Zulu squad roster. Roster access. All right. So just all the people. Okay. And communication logs. What do... Oh, I need 9A clearance. Oh, no. Oh, fine. Oh. <gasps> Army Depot password. Okay, so we needed a password for that. All right, all right, cool, cool, cool. Uh, okay. Well, there we go. We didn't need a key. We needed a passcode. Ooh, we need a... Hello. <laughs> yep, all right. So let's head back this direction. Anything else I missed in here? And I don't think so. Yep. All right, so over to the other area. So the last blocked bit was here. We need the key. Oh God, no! I need a key. Federal Armory key. Crap! I did need a key. Oh God, where's the key? Oh no. Oh, see, it has to be in here. We found the key for this area. Over in that area over there. So, I mean, it's got to be... There's got to there's be a key. 
Ah, crap. <laughs> I mean, it, uh, it would make sense that there is said key. Oh, why did I take that beaker? I did not mean to. Oh, boy. I may have to pause the video or something while I look for this thing because, yeah. We apparently do have to find a key. And with my luck, I've walked right by it at some point. In fact, I'm sure of it. Because that's just... That's how my luck goes. Alright, so it's it's not going to be in that training room. So let's check back around here. No, nothing there. Technical documents. Bullets. No, I don't see anything here. Okay, well, let's check back over this way. The officer's quarters would be the most likely scenario. I'm hoping I just I'm hoping I just overlooked it somewhere in here. And I'm not seeing it. Well, how the crap do I... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Was the password for the... No, because it was an armory password. Hmm. So was there something in the armory I missed? Alright, we might as well check in here. No, it's just shower room. Okay, so, I mean... Hmm. Well, let's check in here. Is there like a computer on one of these that I can access? Oh, hello. I'll take all of you. Is there something... Yeah, it was an armory code, and this is clearly the armory. Is there a... Th oh, no. Let's get on the terminal again here real quick. No. All right, I'm at a loss. Um, I... Hmm... The only thing I can think is maybe there was something back here. I mean, it doesn't make sense to me that there would be something back here. But, I mean, it's the only place. Is there, like, a computer terminal or something that we can unlock? Because where else would we use that armory password? Doesn't, doesn't make, doesn't make sense. No, I'm not seeing anything of value here. Hmm. Yeah, this is the end of the training course. No, oh my god, it's key! Hell yeah. Wait, that's the armory card! Wait, what? Oh god, hold on. <laughs> was this the card I need? I thought I was... Oh no, I'm in the Federal Deep... I'm in the Federal Depot. Uh, all right, back over here. Why did all these doors suddenly close? I don't know. And why was that key card in the firing range? I don't know. There we go. We're in. Ah, freaking hell. <laughs> oh, it's playing that patriotic music again that I turned off intentionally. Oh, hello, Fusion Core. Nice little use of those to hold them up. All right, what do we got here? We do know the password for this. Perfect. Armor sign-out logs. Allocated armor assignments. That's just going to be, yeah, everyone's list for that. Okay, and what? Unlock decontamination bay. I don't know why I wanted to do that. Oh, <gasps> Oh, yeah. That is some beautiful X-01 armor. Oh, and why, man, this sad excuse for Brotherhood Outcast armor. I want in that. <laughs> okay. 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 Well, that is what I'm coming back to. You know, you know what? You know what? 
I'm gonna leave you here. And I'll come back for you. I will come back for you. I want you. Oh, yes. <laughs> Such better armor. Oh, it makes me a happy, happy camper. Perfect. Perfect. All right, I'll be back for you off camera at some point. And okay, so that is it for this facility. That took me longer than I anticipated because I couldn't find that last damn key. I mean, come on, who would have thought it'd be in the room clearing training area? Ah, oh, fine. All right, so let's go back out into the world and we're gonna start to go towards the NCR crash site, but I don't know if I actually want to get into it today because I, I actually was intending for each episode basically to be you know the next sort of underground area the next bunker but because of the my questioning about how much you guys wanted to hear the reading of all the lore I kind of put that off in the brotherhood outcast bunker which kind of tipped the scale on that. So I think this might be a shorter episode today. Well, we at least got to get over to that area. So let's, uh, no, I need to NCR crash site. Oh, though it's a crash site. So is it actually going to be a bunker? I don't know. Well, we'll find out. Let's head over there. And see. Oh. Where am I going? That way. So we will travel across this horrid, barren wasteland. Oh, God thing that came out right in front of me. Take that, Stinger. Oh, yes. Ah, oh, I love this gun for red scorpions. But of course, the Stinger is a great place to hit on them. And that is, uh, this gun is great for shooting appendages. <laughs> All right. So I'm wondering if it's going to be just like a vertebrate crash site or if we actually are going to see like a little bunker. Maybe they took refuge. So let's head this way and find out. And if it is a proper bunker, we will end the episode early today and uh, check that out in the next one and hopefully just do one singular episode for it. So I think that would be a good plan. No, oh, no, I think it would have been better to go around this way. You. Oh, we lost the Nuke World radio signal. What a shame. Okay. Oh, it is a vertebird. All right, let's check this thing out. If it is just a vertebird, then we will... Yeah, just check it out now. Why? Well, might as well. Because that's not going to be much. Oh, nope. They actually... They built into the old sewers... Okay, so yeah, that is going to be next episode then. Oh, I like it. They put the NCR flag on the tree there. Uh, huh. Well, let's get a good look at this vertebrate. Actually, surprisingly intact for having crashed. Huh. Okay. Well, that is going to be it for this episode then. We are going to leave it a little bit early since, uh, yeah, I want this place to be just one solid episode. So that is going to be it for today. I hope you all have enjoyed and of course that you do come back for the next episode when we'll check out what in the world the NCR is doing here. But until then, thank you for watching and as always, have a good one.